Mommy, why did this word on my forehead? It won't come off. Sweetie, that's your soulmate word. Soulmate word? Yes, but the word's not finished yet. Only your soulmate will have the other half of the word. If you think someone has the other half of your word, you can press your heads together. And if your word disappears, that means they're your soulmate. But the word you and your soulmate makes also has meaning. In your case, that isn't very good. Why, Mommy? Because the word represents how your relationship with your soulmate will be. The other half of your word might be heart, which means you'll be heartbroken. <gasps> Look, everyone. Brianna's forehead says broken. That means she's going to have a bad relationship with her own soulmate. You guys don't know that for sure. The other half of my word could be something good. I don't know how the word broken could ever be good. I already met my soulmate. Our word is lovely. Aww. Hey, Brianna. I saw someone today that had heart written on their forehead. Maybe they're your soulmate. It would match your word perfectly. Who? Who is it, Eugene? Show me now. First, you need to do something for me. All right, Eugene, what is it? What do you need me to do for you? I need you to say on video that Eugene is the smartest, coolest, hottest guy in the school. No, Eugene, I'm not saying that. It's not true. Fine, then I won't show you where your soulmate is. <laughs> okay, okay, I'll say it. Eugene is the smartest, coolest, hottest guy in the school. Now say that you mean it and you're not lying. I mean it. I'm not lying. Perfect. <laughs> good. Is that good enough now, Eugene? Now show me where my soulmate is. All right, but first you need to put this on. Remove the blindfold. Ugh. Was a blindfold really necessary, Eugene? Yes, it was. Look, there's your soulmate. Stinky Sam? Eugene, I thought you were going to show me someone who has the word heart on their forehead. Yeah, and I did. It says fart. Sorry about that, Sam. Eugene told me I would meet my soulmate. You don't think we might be soulmates? I don't think fart broken is a word. You said you were looking for the word heart, right? Yeah. I haven't seen that word, but I saw another word that might match yours. I saw someone with un written on their forehead. <gasps> Stinky Sam, who is unwritten on their forehead? Un broken unbroken it matches perfectly with my word that person might be my soulmate i'll tell you who it is but first i have a favor to ask you okay what is it never call me stinky sam again but you smell really really bad that's it i'm not helping you find your soulmate okay fine stinky i mean sam i won't ever call you that again thank you now i'll take you to the guy who has the word unwritten on his forehead his name's jimmy jimmy Hi, Jimmy. Hi, Sam. Hi, Jimmy. Who are you? That's Brianna. She might be your soulmate. That's true. Together, we'd make the word unbroken. It matches perfectly, and that would mean we would have an unbroken relationship. Well, there's only one way to find out if you're my soulmate. Bonk our heads together? Exactly. Ready? <laughs> oh. Ow, you didn't have to bonk my head that hard. Your word is still there. Jimmy, you're not my soulmate. Hey, what's up, you guys? Oh, hey, Timmy. Timmy, I don't think we've met before. I'm... Timmy, your forehead, it says... Timmy, your forehead, it says heart. Timmy, you might be my soulmate. Our words match perfectly. Ah! Timmy, what's wrong with him? Why did he run away? I don't know. He's your soulmate. Timmy! Timmy! Timmy, why are you running from me? We might be soulmates. I'm scared of girls. Well, man up then, Timmy. I'm also scared of love. I don't want to be heartbroken. We're going to bonk heads and see if we're soulmates, okay? Okay. Ready? <laughs> oh... Timmy, your word is gone. So is yours. That means we're soulmates. Yes! Timmy, why don't you look happy? Because the word represents how our relationship will be. We're going to be heartbroken. Oh, right. I forgot about that. Haha, <laughs> you guys are going to have a bad relationship. You're going to be heartbroken. Be quiet Attention, for everyone. Listen up. God, is that you? There's been a misunderstanding on what the soulmate word represents. What the soulmate word really represents is...